Hey guys and welcome to the summit. Now I'm making this video a little impromptu. I just remembered that I forgot a Blu-ray in my last Blu-ray update. If you haven't seen it yet, it's the video before this. Go ahead and stop this, go ahead and check it out and then come back here. I forgot a Blu-ray. My dumb ass forgot a Blu-ray. So I'm going to show you that Blu-ray right now. Mortal Instruments, City of Bones, Blu-ray DVD combo. I know, I know. I already talked about this, but that was a movie review, not a Blu-ray review. So let's do the Blu-ray review of Mortal Instruments, City of Bones. My opinion of the film itself really hasn't changed much since I watched it a second time. This is actually the third time I've seen this movie. Uh, the time before I saw it on DVD. Um, kind of sad that they're not making a sequel. Uh, I know it's not really um, focused towards my age group or my gender even, but uh, I really like the lore in this movie and the Shadow Hunters. That was pretty badass. The special features on this are a little lackluster. There's a few uh, music videos and a couple behind the scenes things. There's deleted scenes and the thing that really bugged me about this is there's no director's commentary. I love the director's commentary on DVDs, uh, Blu-rays, whatever. And um, I was kind of sad that that wasn't on here. But uh, yeah, that's my Blu-ray review of um, Mortal Instruments City of Bones. If you haven't seen my original review for the Mortal Instruments City of Bones, it's back on my Ferris Fish and Blu-rays. you got to go way down in the videos to find it. It's one of the first videos I ever did. Uh, it's a full review of the whole movie and part of the book. Uh, go ahead and check that out if you want to check that out. Now, I want to do something that I haven't done on this channel yet at all, and I know that a lot of people on YouTube do this, a lot of the Bluetubers out there do this. I'd like to do a giveaway, and I just want your opinion on this. Should I do this giveaway? Because I already have the movie twice, and I feel like I want to give it away. I don't know if I have enough subscribers. Maybe I'll get more by doing this. It, that's not the goal. The goal is not to get more subscribers by doing this. It's to help people that, you know, want this Blu-ray and don't have it. If you remember one of my older Blu-ray Quest videos, I went out and got this. The four film Batman collection, the two Tim Burton films, and the two Joel Schumacher films. So I really don't have any use for the Blu-ray that I'm about to show you. I have the Batman Blu-ray. Now, I know you can find this Blu-ray pretty much anywhere, but, um... It doesn't make sense for me to have two copies of it, and I figured I want to do a giveaway. I want to give back to the people that watch the videos, and people that just, you know, can't find it, or don't have the money to buy it online. So, I guess what I want to know is just leave a comment. If anybody wants this, or wants to do a trade for Batman, I'd be down for a trade. Just let me know down in the comments. Give it a like and subscribe. Um, and I'll give you a shout out on my channel. I don't really have a whole lot of uh, rules for this yet. Um, it would be the first time I ever did a trade, it'd be the first time I ever did a giveaway. Um, it's a giveaway slash trade. Uh, but I'll look at like the first five or six people to comment. Uh, send me a uh, message if you are interested in the Batman Blu-ray or want to do a trade with me. Um, I'd be down for that, like I already said. Um, but yeah, Batman. Speaking of trades, I actually want to go to FYE and trade in one of my Blu-rays, Scarface. Now, I don't know if you remember one of my update videos, I talked about Scarface, and I still haven't watched this on Blu-ray, but I was at just a Target the other day, and I'm going to go back to see if they have it, because they just released a new steelbook of Scarface, and it's pretty badass. I'll include a link to that, and I'll put a picture right here. I really want that Blu-ray, and I'm thinking about going to return this, to get some store credit, see what I can do. Also, before I go, I want to give a shout-out to a Bluetuber out there, uh, Blu-ray Dan. Uh, I just talked to him the other day. He's a really nice guy, and he's got a lot of Blu-rays. I mean, this dude is crazy. <laughs> he's got more Blu-rays than I have, and he's got a lot of steelbooks that I'm really jealous of. Um, I'm strictly uh, film in some miniseries, if I can find it on Blu-ray. He pretty much has everything. Uh, TV shows, Blu-ray, uh, TV shows on Blu-ray, everything. Great channel, really nice guy. And uh, go ahead and check him out. He subscribed to my channel after I subscribed to his. So go ahead and give him a subscribe, like his videos. The dude's amazing. He's a really nice guy. Extend that family. This is a weird video for me. I talked about a lot of different things in this video. If you guys like the format of this, let me know down in the comments. Uh, and again, if you want to do a trade or if you want to buy a copy, 
uh, send me a message, comment, you know, like, subscribe, that kind of stuff. I'll give you a shout out and I'll talk about everything. So with that said, I guess that concludes this episode of Zack vs. the Blue Rain Mountain. Stay metal, my friends.